trust me and chuck it in. You can't put cocoa powder in chilli. I'll do it. Pull the spoon. Mum! I promise you it'll be the best thing you've ever eaten. Oh, no. Listen, yes, Uh Yeah, you better do them all if your mates are coming. Mates? From school? Yeah, that you've invited to the party. The one tonight? Yeah, come on, there must be some lads you're desperate to snog. They're all busy. That big bonfire in town. Hey, Operation Guy is go! I'm <laughs> 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 still not convinced this is a good idea. I think it's brilliant. So that's why you wanted me to bring the home farm brochures back. Yeah, we picked them up on the printer. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, hello. It's, uh, it's Mark Wilde here. <laughs> Jolly good to meet you. <laughs> Dad, you're so sick. Oh, darling. It's also marvellous, darling. <laughs> this is Nathan Wilde, international playboy. <laughs> oh, we're not amused. <laughs> <laughs> we agreed last night that the best plan of action was to cut his sordid plans off at source. Yeah, I know, but I couldn't, OK? I tried. But you've got to. Get it out in the open now, before it festers even more. Yeah, I know, but I don't think that I can do that to David. Well, in that case, that piece of work's won. And the poor lad who'd walk over broken glass in bare feet for you, he's left wondering what he's done. Afternoon. Can we help you, Mr Wilde? Uh, I was just popping in to see how you're getting on. Well, in that case, you wouldn't mind popping out again, would you? Because, seeing as it's so quiet, me and Layla are in the middle of her performance review. No, well, I'll, I'll just leave you to it. Yeah, you do that. There's only so much you can do with a rented property. Well, you've done wonders with the place. It's, uh, very imaginative. <laughs> Certainly a lot more homely than it used to be. Mm, it couldn't have been less when we moved in. I want a mustard sausage, even though my sister made them. It's not as if I've spat in them or anything. No, really, really thank you. I'll have one. Thanks. Will? It's like I've fed him. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's all right. There's plenty more where that came from. Listen, enjoy yourself. Cheers. Praising the interior design. Oh, yeah. Wicked. Oh, yeah. What was I supposed oh, to say? Scribe it all jagged and skip. Dark is also functional. <laughs> Farmers are functional people. <laughs> then here comes the icing on the cake. Oh, Ooh, will you uh, ring your dad again? I mean, how long can it take to collect a few cans from the pub? Why do you think he took Dumb and Dumber with him? Oh, we'll get him wrong, and if he doesn't answer, ring Diane and threaten fire and brimstone. There's no way I am hosting this party on my own. Mm. Toffee apples, bless you. Oh, it's the least we could do. Oh. The least Laurel could do, actually. Well, that goes without saying. Oh. She was up oh. the toilet oh. this morning making them. Oh, where is she? Held up at work. Oh, that's a pity. Yeah. Yeah, listen, help yourself to drinks. Let me Ooh. take this before you. What are we going to have after? Oh, what would you like? Oh, I love a good burn up me. Ages it remained you've both been in prison. Oh, wasn't there a riot in the canteen on your stretch? There wasn't, as it happens. Something primitive about our response to fire in the darkness. Something ancient begins to stir. Here, Eric, you better keep that until we're on our own, Eric. Do you mind? <laughs> oh, when our old disaster area romantically is still a bit sensitive. Have a bit of drink. <laughs> No, he's right, you know. The tongue of gunpowder on the night air. There's nothing quite like it. Not something you want to share with your children? They're far too young for loud bangs and explosions. Those guys on top of the fire, they can't be who I think they are, can they? <laughs> Kay's leaving a bit late to make an entrance, isn't she? Maybe that's what she's after. Ah. Maybe we should keep our focus on something closer to home. Yeah, like what? <laughs> the top of that bonfire for starters. Yes. Oh. All right, guys. My wife seems to think you won't be able to take a joke. Really? It depends on what you play humorous. Uh, well, it's nothing sinister. I promise. Well, that's a centuries-old country tradition, isn't it? Burning effigies of the Lord and Lady of the Manor. And their son. And there's me thinking, guys, no, it's only about Guy Fawkes. Yes. See, I told you they'd take it in the spirit in which it's intended. Country tradition, is it kidding? 
bumpkin humour. Really? I'm supposed to find being symbolically burned alive humorous, am I? <laughs> great show. Oh, great. Where's your mother? She's missing all the excitement. Yeah, she should be in Barbados by now. Okay, we drove her to the airport this morning. She figured she needed a little bit of sunshine. Oh, don't we all? Okay, how about set shells after Christmas? <laughs> hmm? Yeah, we should. Oh, we should. <laughs> <laughs> the size of the dog. The dog was a bit off with me this afternoon. I didn't notice. Of course, you wouldn't have said anything, would you? What, like I can't marry my boyfriend because you're blackmailing me? <laughs> I'm just trying to let you know that you can't do bad things and get away with it. You cheated on David, Layla. I don't remember blackmailing you into that. Bravo! That was a Oh, I've got one of those standing next to me. Oh, actually, Thomas. Flatterer. Tell him it won't get him anywhere. No. But it will. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Sally, there you are. Oh, I thought we could all do with a top up. Oh, yes. oh. Yes. Okay. Rather well. Consider it. We had this much fun in ages. <laughs> well, Gabby's under the table with Noah, and uh, Arthur's fast asleep, so I think she's taking a nap. But she's going to need some more fireworks in a minute. Oh, I don't think she's that bothered. I mean, she hasn't exactly had a brilliant time. We must remember next year, no squeaky scary ones. Oh, well, you two are having such a lovely time. Why don't I take the kids home and put them to bed, and you two stay and enjoy yourselves? That's yes, very thoughtful. No, they're my children. My responsibility. No, really. I insist. N and I insist you stay, Sally. I'll take them. I'll be happy to get out of this cold. Sandy, how about you? Well, uh, <coughs> as I'm no longer able to feel my leather regions, I can join you. <laughs> oh, where's Moira? Can't go without saying goodbye. We can. And will. <laughs> Good night. I really wouldn't have minded you. Need. No, you need to get out, meet new people. And you're not going to do that, babysitting our children in our house. She's right. Sooner or later, you're going to have to grasp that net. Indeed, I am. <laughs> when was the last time we did this? Just the two of us. No hairy gooseberry sitting between us on the sofa. <laughs> <laughs> Another drink. Yeah. 